naturally, what do you do first? Before you take the yeah. Yeah. So I say start with your head, right? And right. the question that we have on one of our placards says, before you heal someone, ask them if they're willing to give up the things that got them sick. So for us, lifestyle medicine isn't something that's taught, and prevention, you know, actually 90% of cancers could be eliminated if we would prevent cancers. Not a cure for any, all of them yet, but there will be a better chance of us just not getting it, and part of that is raising your vitamin D levels, going out to the sun. I mean, all of these biohacks that are available right now are really just trying to get us back to the earth. We've gotten so far away from just doing things like walking with no shoes on, on the earth, not on the cement. Um, sleeping when it's dark outside and not watching TV or reading the iPad. So those are simple things. Getting the television out of your bed bedroom, um, unplugging your modem at night, putting the Wi-Fi on a timer. Like you have your Christmas timer light, you put the Wi-Fi. There isn't any reason for it to be asking for a signal. And those electromagnetic, that radiation and those fields are energy, even though we can't see, feel, or taste, or touch it, it's hitting us. Um, turning off Bluetooth, keeping your phones out of your bedroom. But I would say the number one hack is getting a good night's sleep, and exercise is a massive part of that. So um, sleep, D, sunlight, getting back to like kind of being back to the earth, because we're made of energy, we're vibrating at a certain frequency, right? And that electromagnetic charge, that's why mag is so important, because it helps to balance that. That's why vitamin C and these things that we're trying to promote um, is because we've just we've gotten so far away from nature. So grounding um, and protecting yourself from, from that angle. We talk about grounding because I talk about it a lot too. Ground, will I talk what about it? Means. So what does grounding mean? Um, grounding means giving yourself back the, the charge because of the negative ions and the things that we're basically exposed to, we're out of balance. And so without that charge and the heart doesn't beat properly, the vessels, you can't exchange the um, nutrients back and forth and make the cells and the mitochondria, which are your energy packs, do what they're supposed to do. So you ground by taking your feet off and walking on the soil. The number one way to beat jet lag is the immediate moment that you get off that plane wherever you arrive, you go and put your feet on the ground and walk or hug a tree, those guys had it right. So um, we're drawn to the ocean because of the ions, we're drawn to the mountains, we're drawn to this beautiful air, and that's because it's helping to put us back into balance. Um, there are grounding pads, there's grounding mats. We sell bio mats and have people sit on it. Um, saunas can do that. And um, your dog, your cat, those also ground you, right? Um, they're, they're, that's why we're magnetized to them. <laughs> yeah, no, I think, I think 